G'day all, welcome to Southern Cross Amateur Astro and our video user guides for APT. Uh, today we're going to be looking at Web and IP cameras which had a small fix in version 4.41 which is available for download for anyone from the APT website. Uh, in the old 4.40 if you had a USB camera connected and you change the resolution APT would crash but that's all been fixed now. This will be short and sweet, so let's get straight into it. So to get to your webcams in APT, simply go to the Tools tab. At the bottom of the list on the right here is Web Cameras, and click on that. Uh, that'll open up your camera at its default settings the first time you open up APT. Uh, this is mine, 1280 at 720 at 60 frames per second. Generally, you won't want to leave it on the default setting as it... Uh, choose up a bit too much of the bandwidth from your USB too. So go into settings and you'll see all the uh, supported uh, frame rates and everything listed here. At night I generally run the 1920 by 1080 at 2 frames per second which is the lowest uh, bit rate uh, simply because it's only monitoring so if it takes an image every you know, half a second that's fine and you can see what's going on but the color looks terrible in the day so I'm going to set uh, 640 by 480 at 30 but you want to get one that's down a bit so the color is right now at the moment it's uh, flip images selected and that actually flips your image left to right not up and down left to right so if you click on flip image there uh, what it'll do when I hit OK it'll swap this around because that's currently backwards at the moment so I've turned flip image off now if you have an IP camera, of course you will check the IP and enter the address for the camera, the IP address. So you need to know that and it should work. I don't have one at the moment. I am planning on getting one in the next couple of months uh, so I can take it around with me when I go to different locations, uh, especially when I take my caravan out, out to a dark site for a few days, just so I can hang it on the back of the caravan and keep an eye on what's going on from inside. So once you've got the setting you want to use, simply click OK and give it a couple of seconds and it'll switch over so as you see the image is now reversed uh, that's the correct way it should be going and it's running quite well at that setting and you can see what's going on that's my front yard out there of course um, just a little to the left of this garden in the middle is where I generally set up when I'm imaging from home um, I've got some big trees and that around which block a lot of my sky but that's the best location I've got for imaging at home but that's it for the webcam um, once you've got your settings done, of course, APT will remember your settings. So next time I open this up, it will come up at 640 by 480 at 30 frames per second. Um, my default, like I said, I generally go to the slowest bit rate, um, but the images look absolutely awful in that with the bright sky and everything outside. Uh, the sky is pretty bright, but it's cloudy as normal. Ugh, look at that awful colour. <laughs> so that's why I... Yeah, I generally won't use it during the day. That's caused by the bright sky. But that's how you can do it. So you simply just close that down and you're done. And I'll finish this one here, which is all clear skies. And I will see you in another video soon. Take care all.